वेलकम टू डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड टेलीकम्युनिकेशन एट विद्या अलंकार इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी इन दिस डिपार्टमेंट वी हैव टेकन दिस न्यू इनिशिएटिव टू स्टार्ट आवर ओन यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस यूट्यूब चैनल वी आर गोइंग टू अपलोड ऑल ओवर एक्सपेरिमेंट्स वीडियो वैल्यूएटेड कोर्स वीडियो और एनी अदर इम्पॉर्टेंट वीडियोज दिस मटीरियल विल बी अवेलेबल टू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स इन मुंबई यूनिवर्सिटी एंड दिस मटीरियल विल हेल्प स्टूडेंट्स Uh, to enhance their learning not just in their classroom but even outside the classroom i hope that everyone will uh, like this our effort and in case of any query comments anything they can put it in the comment box thank you hello everyone this is digital electronics laboratory we are performing experiment number 2a titled to study various logic gates obtained from a common universal gate that is nand gate nand gate is known as universal gate because various logic gates can be obtained by using this ic components required are ttl ic 7400 patch cords and trainer kit now let's begin with the experiment first we start with the and gate that is we obtain and gate with the help of nand gate this is how we obtain and gate with the help of nand gate first we give inputs uh, a and b to pin number 1 and 2 and take output from pin number 3 so at uh, this end we get a dot b whole bar now this output of first gate goes as input to the second gate and the four and five pins are shorted and output is taken out from six sixth pin uh, after this uh, operation we get a dot b bar whole bar this now this is how we obtain and gate with the help of nand gate now we are done with all the connections uh, we use two gates of uh, nand to get and gate one and two are the inputs three is the output which goes as input to the second gate that is 4 5 four and five is shorted and six is taken out as the output and given to the logical indicator seven is connected to ground 14 is connected to vc now let's check the truth table of and Let's switch on the power. For zero zero, we are getting no indication. That means uh, the output is zero. For zero one also, the output is zero. For one zero also, the output is zero. And for one one, uh, we get indicator. That means output is one. And uh, AND gate is verified using NAND gate. Similarly, we can get OR gate with the help of NAND gate. Let's make the connections for this. This is how we obtain OR gate with the help of NAND gate. Over here, uh, we give input A and short pin number one and two and take output from three. So this becomes A bar. And over here, pin number four and five are shorted and output is taken from pin number six. So this becomes B bar. A bar and B bar are given are given as input to the third gate that is pin number nine and ten and output is taken from uh, pin number eight. So the this equation after this becomes. A bar dot B bar the whole bar because we are adding the the this A dot B. Now using De Morgan's law, uh, we separate the equation and we get A plus B. This is how we get OR gate. So now we are done with the connections uh, discussed as per the circuit diagram we showed before. Uh, so now we obtain OR gate with the help of NAND gate. Let's verify the truth table. For zero zero we are getting output zero. For zero one we are getting output one. For one zero we are getting output one, and for one one we are getting output one. Hence we verified OR gate with the help of NAND gate. Similarly, we can uh, obtain NOT gate with the help of NAND gate. Now let's make the circuit connections. Since NOT gate requires only one input, therefore we short pin number one and two and give it as A input and output is taken from third pin. Hence we obtain NOT gate with the help of NAND gate. So now we are done with the connections of NOT gate. One and two is shorted and given as input. Three is taken as output. Fourteen is VCC. Seven is ground. Now let's verify the truth table for NOT. For zero, we are getting input uh, output as one, and for one, we are getting output as zero. So, hence the NOT gate is verified with the help of NAND gate. Similarly, we can obtain NOR gate with the help of NAND gate. Now, let's make the circuit connections. 
This is how NOR gate is obtained with the help of NAND gate. First, we short pin number 1 and 2 and uh, take output from pin 3. At the end of this, we get A bar. And then the second gate is used. We short pin number 4 and 5 and output is taken from pin number 6. We get B bar at the end of this. This A bar and B bar, that is pin number 3 and 6, is uh, shorted with pin number 9 and 10. And we output is taken from 8th pin. The equation after this is, uh, since we are ending this, uh, A bar dot B bar, the whole bar we will get after this. And the output of uh, gate number 3 is given to input of gate number 4. Uh, 8 is given to pin number 12 and 13 and these three are shorted together. And output is taken from uh, 11th pin. Hence the equation obtained is that of NOR gate. We have made the circuit connections as we discussed before. Uh, with the help of circuit diagram. Now let's check the output that is truth table of NOR gate. For 0, 0 we get 1, for 0, 1 we get 0, for 1, 0 we get 0 and for 1, 1 also we get 0. Hence truth table for NOR, NOR is um, verified with the help of NAND gate. Similarly we can obtain XOR gate with the help of NAND gate. Now let's obtain the circuit connections. This is how we obtain XOR gate with the help of NAND gate. The input A and B is given to gate number 1, that is pin number 1 and 2 and output is taken from pin number 3. The equation obtained after this is A dot B, the whole bar. Now we give uh, input of gate number 1 as input to gate number 2 and 3, that is pin number 1 and 4 are shorted, 2 and 9 are shorted. The output of gate number 1, that is pin number 3, is shorted with uh, input of gate number 2 and 3, that is 5 and 10. The output obtained after this is at pin number 6 and pin number 8 respectively and the equation obtained are as follows, this one and this one. Now the outputs of gate number 2 and 3 are given to given as input to gate number 4 that is pin, at pin number 13 and pin number 12 respectively and output is taken from pin number 11. The final equation obtained is as follows. This equation can be simplified like this. If you want to obtain XNOR gate with the help of XOR gate, uh, we just need to add one NOT gate over here that is not obtained from NAND. So we get this. XNOR equation. So now we are done with the circuit connections as shown uh, uh, previously with the help of circuit diagram. Let's check the truth table for XOR. For 0, 0, we get 0. For 0, 1 we get output as 1, for 1, 0 we get output as 1 and for 1, 1 we get output as 0. Similarly, we can uh, get x nor by adding a not gate uh, by, by using NAND gate at the end. 